The CT2 from BG Products is a power flush coolant transfusion system. It's fast, safe, durable, efficient, economical, and easy to use. The BG CT2 operates by pumping backwards against normal coolant flow direction without having to run the engine. This creates an excellent OEM recommended back flush without having to cut hoses or deal with hot scalding coolant. It will make your shop money in the quick, easy delivery of a valuable automotive service. After just a couple of uses, the BG CT2 will prove its simplicity and its versatility. To begin the BG CT2 service, first connect the suction wand to the end of the pump hose. Make sure the on-off switch is in the off position and connect the BG CT2 to a 12-volt power source. As always, assume all cooling system components are hot and handle each part with proper protective gloves, shop towels, and any other needed protection to prevent scalding. Remove the radiator cap from the vehicle. It is important that the engine has been allowed to cool for as long as possible. Insert the wand end of the pump hose into the radiator. Turn the control valve to used and turn the pump switch to the remove from vehicle position. Take out a sufficient amount of coolant to allow for a dry removal of the upper radiator hose. Turn off the pump switch. Now move the suction wand to the recovery tank. Turn the pump switch to remove from vehicle until the recovery tank is completely empty. Turn off the pump switch. Assemble the CT700 upper radiator hose adapter set according to its instructions. Now attach the CT700 to the upper radiator hose. The CT700 is non-directional and cannot be installed backwards. Add one 11 ounce bottle of BG cooling system flush into the mouth of the radiator. Insert the wand back into the radiator and turn the pump switch to return to vehicle. Fill the radiator and replace the cap. Open the ball valve on the CT700. Start the engine and allow to run for 15 to 20 minutes to circulate the flush. Turn off the engine and close the ball valve on the CT700. Connect the pump hose to the engine side and the return hose to the radiator side. On vehicles where the thermostat is on the lower radiator hose, simply reverse the hoses at the CT700 adapter so that the pump hose is toward the radiator and the return hose is toward the engine. Also, make sure to pinch off the small hose connecting the radiator to the recovery tank. Turn the control valve to transfusion. Turn the pump switch to transfusion. Run the BGCT2 until both hoses show clean coolant or until the desired amount of new coolant has been installed. When the transfusion is complete, turn off the BGCT2 and open the ball valve on the CT700 to release any pressure in the system. Disconnect the hoses from the CT700. Slowly remove the radiator cap. Connect the wand to the pump hose. Make sure the control valve is set to new and turn the pump switch to remove from vehicle. Lower the coolant to a sufficient level to allow for a dry removal of the CT700 adapter. Reconnect the radiator hose to the radiator. Install appropriate BG cooling system inhibitors into the radiator. Place the wand back into the radiator and turn the pump switch to return to vehicle. Fill the radiator and turn off the pump switch. Move the wand to the recovery tank. Turn the pump switch to return to vehicle to fill the recovery tank to its proper level. 
Replace the radiator cap and disconnect the connectors from the battery. Start the engine and check for leaks. Refilling and emptying the BGCT2 may be done manually by simply removing the new and used coolant containers from the unit. The BGCT2 can also be emptied and refilled without removing the containers. First, attach the connectors to a 12 volt power source. To empty the used coolant container, set the control valve to used. Attach the wand to the pump hose. and place it into an appropriate used coolant storage container. Turn the pump switch to empty CT2 tank. This will evacuate the contents of the onboard used coolant container. Now turn off the switch. To refill the new coolant container, turn the control valve to new. Move the wand into a container of new 50-50 or appropriately diluted ready-to-use coolant. Turn the pump switch to fill CT2 tank. To change coolant types and avoid any cross contamination, simply place the wand on the pump hose into a small amount of water. Turn the control to used and turn the pump switch to remove from vehicle to purge the BG CT2 plumbing. The BG CT2 is now ready to service the next vehicle. BG Products Incorporated provides the BG CT2 cooling system service as part of its complete maintenance awareness program. For more information on this or any other service, contact your BG representative. BG Products Incorporated is your partner in service success.